is known and today we're gonna look at the scripture which is in Philippians 3 and verses 14. Philippians 3 verse 14 it says I press towards the mark for the prize of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus reading from the King James Version and if we look at the um, complete Jewish Bible it says I keep pursuing the goal in order to win the prize offered by God's up upward calling in the Messiah Yeshua amen and this is Paul speaking to the Philippians and um, you know this the Christian life is one can be likened unto a race. Amen. We read in other scripture or it can be likened unto a journey. Right? And of course the one who is leading this journey is our Lord and Saviour, Jesus or Yeshua. And Paul is saying here, he keep on pursuing the goal because at the end of the journey or at the end of the race the ultimate is to get the prize amen so he's he's encouraging the philippians people to pursue this goal regardless and the thing about a race and one thing i should mention this race is not a sprint it's more of a marathon race, this race, this walk in, this walk with God. It's one of a marathon. And if you try to do it in your own flesh, you're going to burn out. You try to do it your own way, you will burn out. But it's a marathon. You pace yourself in, in, in Christ. You allow him to, to generate that energy and, and give you the strength to go whether it be uphill downhill you know and as you progress you mature you gain strength you know as the scriptures say you know you will mount up with wings as eagle you know you will soar in the wind and stuff you know so we we are encouraged to keep pursuing regardless of covid and all that's happening around in you know in our world today we see it on the news. There's a lot, lot of negativity and, and struggles, killings, you name it. All these sort of things are there presenting themselves while you're on course, on that road running. When you, you're in that race, you know, uh, we come across all sort of things, all sort of hurdles to cause us to stumble and to fall. But God says, um, Paul is saying for us to keep on pursuing it. Keep our eyes on, on Christ so that we will endure and gain that prize. We are encouraged to forget the things. I mean, we, as I said, we're in this race and we may come across hurdles and stuff like that. Christ will help us to get over the hurdles as we put our trust in Him. In him. And you know, you, you come across, you come over this hurdle, you pass it and you move on to something new. And so Paul is saying, forget those things behind. Forget that last hurdle that was yesterday. Let's look forward tomorrow for the new day. And Christ, um, which Christ will allow us to and to get through on our race. Because the Bible says, he that endure it to the end only he that endure it yeah if we go back to uh, for those of us who know about the race with the the hare and the third and the turtle or tortoise and stuff but it's um regardless if you're um you know the hare is supposed to be a really fast runner but he lost the race yeah but We've got to put our trust. It's this the race, the, the 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 endurance of the race doesn't depend on us, human ability, but it's God's given ability 
and it's with God's um, help that we will enjoy the race. That's my encouragement to you today. So put your trust in Christ and he will sustain you. He will deliver you. He will give you that enduring power, that effectiveness to complete your individual marathon. Keep on pursuing, brethren.